see you, but jeez. <laughs> I can see you. It's like this is this is dimmer than it often is. This is better. This is better. All right, I'll take I'll take you guys. I'll take your word. Um, so I mean, this is my first time doing this. Uh, I just wanted to kind of get a feel for what it feels like to be on stage and kind Woo! of. Wait, ever? Ever. Ever. birthday present because uh, like gifts are really overrated at this point and public humiliation is in so I'm gonna try it out um, <laughs> that was a uh, that was not a good start um, let's see uh, so when I told my family that I wanted to try stand up uh, they took it a little too well they were too supportive <laughs> for my taste um, I told them I wanted to do it, and they're like, all right, yeah, you should do it. Like, just do it in front of us. Like, we'll, we'll tell you if it's good or not. And I was like, that's not a good idea. Like, you guys are more savage than any stranger to possibly be. <laughs> like, these are the people who, when I was growing up, they would look at me and they would call me, like, stupid dumb. Like, that's, like, the roast that my, my family came up with. Like, my mom, she was just like... Like, stupid was not enough, dumb was not enough, she called me stupid dumb. So it's just like, that was like the first of like, when people say, like, that's good, good, they already had it packed down. They said, that's stupid, <laughs> dumb. God. <laughs> um, what else? Uh, so I'm, I'm from Iowa, and... Yeah, yeah, that's a good reaction, I like that. Um, yeah, no, 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 that, that's the reason why I'm from Iowa and I've moved since. Uh, coming to Minnesota, like, being in Iowa, like, everyone's dream in Iowa is to move out of Iowa. <laughs> and that's the goal. Like, I've never seen Field of Dreams. I think it's about baseball, but I also think it's probably about leaving Iowa. Uh, <laughs> uh, but, like... Moving to a big city is super nice. Um, just like you have more than more Walmart, and it, it's crazy. Like just I, I didn't know what to do with myself when I came here, and there's more than more Walmart. But like Walmart for you guys is like low tier. Like that is that is like when there's nowhere else to go, you guys go to Walmart. Uh, but for like me, like I grew up in Iowa, and the town was 25,000 people. And Walmart was like the place to hang out. Like, I would call up my friend, like Trevor, and be like, yo, you wanna hang out? I'd be like, yeah, cool, let's hang out. And he's like, you wanna go to Walmart? Yeah, dude, let's go to Walmart. Let's, yeah, let's go peruse around the game section, see what's happening there. That, that's what you do in Iowa. If you guys were ever wondering what you do in Iowa, that's what you do in Iowa. Peruse around Walmart. Um, yeah, other than that, I mean, like, people tell me, like, oh, you moved to Minnesota, isn't that a lot colder? Like, isn't that worse? And I said, no, it's actually, it's not that bad at all. Like, they actually know what they're doing. I guess that's <laughs> even a joke. They actually know what they're doing. Like, they, they pre-salt their roads. Like, it's a crazy concept. They pre-salt their roads so that when it snows, you don't know, slip on the ice. Like, what? I guess that, yeah, we just haven't learned that yet. Um... Like, I guess from, when you say you're from Iowa, it's like, I guess people in Minnesota, they think it's like so far away. Like, you're from Iowa? Like, I've, I've never even been to Iowa. Like, I don't know anything about Iowa. I've never gone through Iowa. And, I, like, it doesn't make any sense to me. Like, Wisconsin's so close. Wisconsin's just as close. <laughs> but, like, if you say you're from Wisconsin, like, you guys know for sure. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, we've been across. Like, Hudson, you know, Hudson, Hudson. And like Iowa is just like nothing, nothing at all. Uh, <laughs> let's see, what else? I don't, what do, what do stand-ups even talk about? Uh, jokes. <laughs> yeah, I didn't, I didn't bring any jokes this time. <laughs> I wasn't that prepared. You did stand up. I did stand up. Yeah, this may be the last time. We'll see. Never. No. Never. No. Yeah. No. Keep going. Uh, what else we got? So when I was growing up, uh, you, have, you may have noticed that I'm Asian uh, at this point, oh, okay. and uh, also, like, I just found that out. Like, <laughs> like, I just, like, growing up, 
back to Iowa. Growing up, it's just, it's, everyone around me was American. Everyone was white. And so, like, it never even occurred to me. Like, I was just like, yeah, these are my, all my friends. Like, I'm growing up with them. Like, we do the same stuff. Like, we all want to be basketball players. Like, we're going to do it. And, uh, and it just, it didn't, it, didn't, it didn't pan out. Like, uh, I ended up at, like, 5'5". Five five. Like, that's not the prom basketball hype. Uh, the dream lives on. Um, but, like, yeah, like, growing up, just, like, besides my parents, who were Asian, like, everything else around me was just, like, American. And so, I, I don't know, like, like when I go back, like, we, we go back to Malaysia every once in a while, and, um, like, they don't even accept me for being Asian, because, like, I don't, I, I speak a little bit, but they know, like, they know that, like, I'm a foreigner, so... It's, it's weird, because I'm like a foreigner there, and then I'm also a foreigner here, so I'm like in the middle ground, kind of just like hanging out, swinging from one place to another. Is the dude standing up yet? Yes. Oh, perfect. That's my time, guys. <laughs>